As against Amber Heard, we, the jury, award compensatory damages in the amount of $10 million. As against Amber Heard, we, the jury, award punitive damages in the amount of $5 million. Johnny is finally going to be $10 million richer as he has been approved to get all his money from Amber to the last penny. The public is aware that JD won the legal battle against Amber, but another thing everyone is aware of is that Amber is yet to pay the Pirates of the Caribbean actor. In the verdict, the jury stated Depp should receive $10 million in compensatory damages and $5 million in punitive damages, but the judge reduced the punitive damages award to $350,000 under a state cap, but Amber has said she plans to appeal the verdict. And trust me, that might not change anything. During a recent hearing, the judge said that if Heard appeals, she must post a bond for the full amount of the $10.35 million awards while the appeal is pending. The judge's order says both awards are subject to 6% interest per year. She would also need to add $480,000 in interest payments. Well, that doesn't exactly sound like great news for Amber since whether or not she appeals, she needs to pay JD. Also, according to the Post, the judge entered Depp's version of the verdict on paper and rejected all of Heard's proposed edits. Looks like Amber is gradually running out of luck. Although it looks like it's ultimately Johnny Depp and his lawyer's decision on whether or not to pursue the $10 million sum from Amber Heard. But they could resort to seizing her home and properties and yes, that's legal. Alternatively, the teams might instead make a new deal, passing on the money in exchange for Heard's silence on certain issues and dropping the appeal. Throughout the defamation trial in Virginia, Johnny Depp and his legal team insisted that their case wasn't ultimately about money. Then again, we also learned about the financial issues the actor might be going through. Depp's pair of lawyers recently appeared on GMA to speak about the verdict, with Ben Chu asked whether or not they're pursuing the $10 million. He responded with, We obviously can't disclose attorney-client communications, but as Mr. Depp testified and as we both made clear in our respective closings, this was never about money for, for Mr. Depp. So this was about restoring his reputation, and he's done that. Depp's fans have been furious that Amber has been cutting corners to avoid this payment, but with the recent legal development, Amber might have no choice but to pay JD. One of Depp's fans wrote, I has to come up with the amount of money she owes Depp to go into a bond before she can appeal. She has 10 days to do it. Her lawyer has said she can't pay Depp this, so I would think she can't appeal. Another fan wrote, seriously? How will she pay said amount? She's at best been abbot of eye candy and rolls a few years back now her looks have gone and after losing the case she'll never work again in Hollywood so what will happen? That'll be all for now. Stay connected to enjoy more news about the two Hollywood celebrities.